Where's my son? What? Right, you. Pack your stuff up. <coughs> Say, excuse me. He's leaving this school. Now, shift it. No way. Get out of my class before I call the police. You don't tell me what to do. On your feet, now. Leave me alone, will you? You, go and get Mr Rimmer. What, do you want me to wrestle you out? You're off your head. For the last time, will you leave my classroom? Sod you. Right, everybody out for safety. What are you doing? Mr Aspinall has lost control of his senses. Why are you such a bully? He told you don't want to leave. Well, I'm his father and he does what I tell him. What the bloody hell's going on? Would you please remove this bully from my classroom, Mr Rimmer? I'm here to remove my son. For God's sake, Roger. I warned you, Rimmer. I suggest we go to my office. I've got some other issues to raise with you. You're making a fool of yourself. He's lost it. Mr. Aspinall. You don't talk me down in front of my own son. with Hinchcliffe. The board's on my side. I'm entitled to have my views taken into Your account. Your son wants to stay at Waterloo Road. How many times have I got to tell you he's not being taught here? We're trying to see both sides of this, Roger. Do you want me to take my money away? <laughs> Put them plans in a bin? We definitely don't want that. Do we, Jack? I don't think Roger would do anything so hasty. Well, I'm not putting another penny into this place till there's a head teacher here who's on my wavelength. You won't even get an interview. Can't we talk about this, Roger? Yeah, before you make up your mind. Jack! Fine. You'll soon be a street rimmer. When I get the go-ahead for the academy, I'll have my say on all the staffing. Er, uh, Roger. What's this? This is how Roger earns his money, Andrew. Although I'm sure he wouldn't like me to prove that to the Board of Governors. So much for local boy makes good, eh? Look, I know it's porn, but my whole workforce depends on that income to feed their families. This is money laundering. Well, as soon as I get this big MOD contract, it'll all be straightened out. Yeah, well, meanwhile, I've got a major headache here. I can't be seen to be financing the school from the porn industry. What do you mean, you can't be seen? You can't do it, full stop. I like to solve problems, me. Jack, this isn't on. If it's found out we're educating our children on the back of porn magazines... Yeah, but we're not. Porn finances Rogers Offshore Company, which finances Aspinall Industrial Fixings, which is going to finance the school. Isn't that right, Roger? Strictly speaking? Strictly speaking, we're breaking the law. Oh, don't be so pole-faced. It's not like the mums and dads don't use a bit of porn themselves, is it? Jack! Of course, if, if we are going ahead with this, then certain things will have to change. Like, for example, the name of the school. Eh? Hey? Roger Aspinall Academy. It's a bit of a hostage to fortune, isn't it? I mean, you might as well call it the Big Baps Academy. <laughs> Please don't tell my son. Yeah, well, maybe there's a lot you're not telling him. Like what? Look, there's been a flaming war going on between you. About something that happened after his mum died. Now, that's for you and him to sort out. But you better add, Roger, if you want your plans for Waterloo Road to go ahead. Right, leave it with me. Excellent. And, er... Uh, I trust this means that my future here is assured, yeah? I think we understand each other. <laughs> 